Hey guys, Nick here again for my Linux experiment and today I'd like to show you something about uh, elementary OS, about how I use it, how it works, how it looks and show you a few tips and tricks to help you better understand why I chose this distribution. So what you might first see is this beautiful desktop background which is provided by default by elementary OS, uh, a top panel and a dock that might be reminiscent of Mac OS X, that's because they took a lot of inspiration from it. So Elementary OS is a Linux distribution based on Ubuntu, which is one of the most used distributions uh, in the world. It's based on the LTS version. Uh, oops, what did I do there? Uh, LTS version, uh, which means long-term support, which means that all the packages and software is going to be not the latest, greatest version, but very stable. But Elementary OS builds its own desktop environment on top of it, which is called Pantheon, and which includes this top bar right there and this bottom bar down there. So first thing you will notice is what the shit is that? Well, it's jeudi, it's, uh, it's Thursday in French, and that just means that I am French, so I'm using my system in French. So, there we go. Uh, let's start by the top panel, which is called Wink Panel. Uh, it hosts your app menu which scrolls nicely and which shows also apps in categories or lists. You can of course uh, search here or even type commands and run commands to kill programs or do stuff. You have your calendar here, uh, in French here of course, and this is your notification and system menu which helps you to log out, shut down the computer, see the battery, the sound, Bluetooth, etc. Down there you have the dock which holds all your app shortcuts. Uh, well, these are my apps, so pretty standard lineup uh, Firefox, uh, Photos, GIMP, Inkscape, PTV for uh, video editing. Of course, Steam and Lutris, which I will talk about more in another video, and a trusty terminal which on the elementary just looks super beautiful. So that's it for the basics. Uh, they implemented what they call the multitasking view, so let's see what it would look like if I open a few windows. Uh, it basically works like Exposé on Mac OS X. So it shows you all your windows, you can close them with a middle mouse click or just by clicking on the little cross or click on one to select it. That is pretty easy. And that's about it. Uh, it also allows you to go to virtual desktops. So you can switch from virtual desktops, click on something, open a window there, which, will, which we will do right there. Okay, that was my journal. And there we go. So that's the basics. Uh, you also have a few handy tricks like maximizing a window by dragging on the top or just snap it to a side right or left. That's pretty neat. And that's about the window management. What you will want to know about Elementary OS is that it is based on their own program. So you will have your file manager which is developed by Elementary OS which is, which is basically just called files. They have their own calendar app which I do not use because I don't really use a calendar right now. I will maybe in the future. That's about it for Elementary OS. Uh, it's just a simple video to show you how it works and uh, to also help me edit videos because I'm a beginner at this. Hope you enjoyed, see you guys.